Hello, it is Plurus. Thanks for joining us again and welcome back to another exciting and informative video on our YouTube channel. If you are joining us for the first time, we want to thank you for watching our videos. Today, I want to talk about something completely different that you may wonder, like, why are we talking about this? I just want to discuss about the Atlantic International University. This university is not an accredited institution, just so you know. We have a number of viewers and people watching our videos from around the world, especially from the African continent and across Europe, across the United States, across Asia and from all over the world. Now, the Atlantic International University is an institution that is not recognized by the US government. It's not recognized by the US Secretary of Education. So you know, the number of African students who have paid money to this university. And today, um, their money, is, um, their qualification that they obtain is not recognized. Atlantic International University offers both bachelor's degree. It's a university that was founded in 1998 in the United States. Um, it offers bachelor's, master's, also offers um, uh, doctoral program, postdoctoral courses, uh, diplomas, basically online. Now, for students who are basically coming from the African continent, who are our viewers, and for those of you who benefit from this information, there is just no need for you to put in your hard-earned currency at this institution. The degree that is granted at this institution is not recognized in the United States. This university, the Atlantic International University, has had a number of uh, issues with regards to the U.S. Uh, government. Now, um, its accreditation has been called into question. The Atlantic International University has been prosecuted generally by the Office of Consumers Protection and also um, uh, by the state of Hawaii. So I'm really wondering why uh, students will go to their website. Now, if I can show you a number of things to clarify that this university is actually not accredited. Now, there are a number of doctors in the African continent, students who have master's degree from this university, cut out across North, across Sub-Saharan Africa. Now, I don't see why uh, you should put in your hard earned money without you doing your research. Now, the fact that a university is located in the United States or in the UK, or across Europe or in Asia, doesn't necessarily mean that they are not fake. There are a number of fake schools in the US, a lot of fake universities in the United States, fake universities across Europe, and fake universities in Asia. Now, don't be taken advantage of. I see that a lot of these students, or most of these students, um, have been taken advantage of. And recently, Rwanda Department of Education just called out students who graduated from the International University, uh, the Atlantic International University. So I'm really wondering why people shouldn't do the research and then they are going ahead and paying money to the school. There are a number of doctors. It's our responsibility here at the Explorer to uh, bring you informative content and to let you know. We've, we've promised that in 2022, we shall be coming in once in a while to bring you some very informative things that will add value into uh, your own lives. And the fact that you are our viewers, we also want to make sure that we provide you some life-changing information that will support you make some informed decision. If you are an African who is studying, or you are my viewers or our viewers viewing me from around the world, and you're having a quality, you're studying with the Atlantic International University, you want to review that, that particular thing because uh, that study option might not lead you to anywhere. It's because your qualification will not be recognized by employers. Your qualification will be challenged. Um, the qualification cannot be converted to um, uh, another recognized qualification. Now, in Rwanda, for example, the Department of Education there has moved swiftly to, um, to call out students who actually had um, an accreditation in place or a conversion of that qualification from Atlantic International University was given to them. Now, their degree has been called into question. There is an investigation going on, and I assure you that um, these students qualification equivalent will be withdrawn. Now, why do you have to spend that much money? I see qualifications there for thousands of dollars. 
Now, it might sound cheap as compared to other standard or traditional university, but there is just no need for you to pay that amount of money just to study uh, for with a degree that you're not gonna do anything. Now, let me show you an example on the website of this uh, university to tell you that it is not accredited. Now, this is the website of uh, Atlantic International University. I'll put it more straightforward. Uh, when you come to the website, this is what it looks like. Um, for students who don't know, mostly African students come into the site and get confused with the, all of these pictures that you find here. And more importantly, uh, you, they're just looking around. Now, when you are looking this page, the first thing you can see the accreditation you can look at the admissions process and also programs. They offer different programs, masters, doctoral programs, postdoctoral, you also have bachelor's courses, and they do have associate certificates, programs, and uh, other courses that are basically standards with any other university. But the key thing here is this university is not accredited. Now, I just wanted to point that out. When you get to the accreditation page, what you should do to figure out that this institution is not accredited, to see it yourself, what you need to do, you come into the accreditation page. Scroll down here and click on to accreditation. Now you move the page down a little bit just to have things. It's written here accreditation. Now, when you read, this is where I'm going to explain to you how everyone can know that, especially the African students who have no idea or how to figure this out. And a lot of people have been, they, they've, they've just been, um, I don't know how to put it, but they lose money in paying for qualifications that will not be recognized in the future. And there are a number of African doctors, African um, master's degree holders, bachelor's degree holders who graduated from this school and they've just wasted their money. Now, um, looking at this, what happens here is Atlantic International University is accredited by Accreditation Service for International Schools and Colleges and Universities, the ASIC. The university has earned premier status with ASIC for its commendable areas of operation. ISEC accreditation helps students and parents make a more informed choice with also helping schools, colleges, universities, training providers and distance education providers demonstrate to the international students body that they are high quality institution. And then this says nothing with regards to uh, the accreditation of this school. Now, where it gets more interesting is here. You see, the ISEC here, you see, it's a recognized by the ASIC. It's recognized here, as you can see, in the UK, not in the United States, in the UK. It is a member of the CHEER, International Quality Group, the USA. So the point out, listed as an international directory, the member of the BQF, the British Qualification Foundation, are affiliate of this particular ENQ, which is a European network for quality assurance and institutional member of the EDEN. EDEN stands for European Distance and E-Learning Networks, ISEC affiliations and credentials. Again, this says nothing with regards to the accreditation of the Atlantic International University. Drive down a little bit more, it's getting even more interesting. I'm going to lay down to you the, the section which clearly states that this institution is not accredited in the United States. I wonder how African students and students from around the world uh, will see all of these and they will still go ahead and um, pay for courses that are offered here. Highlight this. If you scroll down this page, after reading all of this conversation, all this literature is meant to get you confused. Now. Um, they're going to mention all of this, like, for example, the university is based in the United States and was established by the Corporate Charter in 1998. Their founding principles are based on the United Nations Universal Declaration of Human Rights, by Article 26. And now, it got nothing to do with accreditation. Accreditation is pretty simple. 
Are you recognized by the Department of Education in your country? Now, it's not people should not be confused with professional accreditation and academic accreditation. So it's so important. Now, when you scroll down, as I've highlighted this section, this is where they made it clear the institution itself has clearly stated it here that they are not accredited in the United States. It's clear the university is written here that Atlantic, pretty much, I'm just going to highlight it again. Atlantic Universe, International University is not accredited by the accrediting agency recognized by the United States Secretary of Education. They've highlighted it. In the United States and abroad, many licensed authorities recognize accreditation degrees and the basis of eligibility for licensing. In some cases, accredited colleges may not accept for transfer courses and degree completed at unaccredited colleges, and some employers and may require accredited degrees as a basis for eligibility for employment. Potential students should consider how they are both may affect their interest. Atlantic International University respects the unique rules and regulations of each country and does not seek to influence the respective authorities in those particular countries. In the event that prospective students wishes to carry out any government review or processes in regulation to this, the university they recommend and uh, require that such are being explored in details. So this university is not accredited in the United States. There is just no need to have any conversation about this. Students should not pay to not make this to be a conversation. That's the reason why countries like Rwanda and other regional uh, institutions or countries in the continent of Africa have called out this institution. Hopefully, I've made this clear, I've pointed out to you that Atlantic International University is not accredited, and you all have seen that yourself. I don't see any need, any reason why you should pay your money to this school. So, I want to thank you for watching this episode. Hopefully, I've informed you so you don't, you are not misled to this particular um uh, scam so to point out now it, it is it is really interesting it's fascinating to see that people worked their heart and money a number of students across the african continent believe or fall this um uh, this scam in education thinking that the universities across the african continent do not offer anything better of course this happens because of the little challenges but again, you need to do your, your due diligence. There are a number of fake schools in the UK, especially, and across Europe. Universities set up that are not recognized by the local governments or the Department of Education in this country. Now, don't get confused with professional accreditation and academic accreditation. These are two different things, just so you know. So the Atlantic International University has duped a lot of African students over the years who have graduated from this school. Now, a lot of these departments of education in Africa do not know. They might not have conducted enough research to figure this out. Now, students who don't know fall into this trap and then take this qualification and use it in the continent. When you look at that, this is something that is not correct. And most departments of education in Africa should check out the qualifications of students or professionals who graduated from this school. The Atlantic International University is not accredited in the United States. Do you know someone who studies at this university? Or you have a family member or a friend who is currently studying at Atlantic International University? Then you need to check out and call them out. Now, this university also, it is important to know that uh, it, it is um, it is something which I, I find that really um, amazing that um, uh, the, the university will continue to um, because they say that they are for profit. Of course, um, it's completely distance learning uh, the way they conduct the studies. Um, you don't have any um, regular campus. So to point out, um, since 1998, I've been running this uh, for, for a while now. Now, it is interesting to, to figure that out that uh, most African students are falling victim to this 
and the Department of Education in the continent uh, should carry out rigorous research with regards to this. And this school, um, it, it's basically found uh, in, in Honolulu, in, in, in Hawaii. So um, the fact that it's found in, in, in Hawaii does not necessarily mean that it, it is recognized, or in the United States in, in particular, now, I feel sorry for students who have paid uh, huge sums of thousands of dollars to acquire a degree that um, would not uh, translate to something important to uh, uh, maybe transform their own lives or transform the lives. We just want to thank you for watching. Hopefully, we've informed you with regards to uh, this fake university called Atlantic International University. If you know someone that studied here, please inform them. If you know a Department of Education or you're working at the Department of Education in your country, please check out this university. We want to help the Rwandan authorities as well. Um, we're flagging this out to let you know that this school, you can go Google it yourself and find out the Atlantic International University in Hawaii, Honolulu. Thank you very much. We're looking forward to meeting you soon in our next episode and have a wonderful day. Bye bye of uh, their student.